all successful people have a wonderful quality that is self control extremely helpful skill it's the quality that all people admire self control should not be confused with risk avoidance all successful people are calculated risk takers on the other hand people with low self control may take uncalculated and unmanageable risk that are essentially irrational self control is the ability to have a control on one's emotions desires and impulses to avoid distractions and temptations to achieve targeted goals self control also means self discipline self restraint or will power it's all about managing our thoughts and actions to avoid frustrations embarrassment misery pain and problems first you should know what is good and bad for us for example when a doctor urges a patient to lose weight self control prevents them from eating too much junk food self control also means going to the gym instead of staying home to watch tv self control is getting started on a project early instead of postponing it emotional self control prevents us from screaming at others when we are angry or from punching someone when they wrong us it also stops us from crying uncontrollably when we do not get our way common goals such as exercising regularly eating a balanced diet giving up bad habits saving money are just a few worthwhile ambitions that usually require a self control to achieve too little or too much self control both can lead to depression or anxiety you might be wondering what is healthy amount of self control looks like well if someone behavior works for them and causes little or no pain no suffering embarrassment that's the healthy amount of self control some genius are born with self control while some has to work upon it who lack self control low self control is common among teenagers and immature people people who are subjected to physical sexual and emotional abuse or neglect if there is pre existing or family history of mental illness some drug addicts or alcoholics who feeling more in control of yourself and your actions can lead to feeling more in control of life feeling more empowered about who you are and thus helping boost your self worth and making you more confident students who have greater self discipline had better grades higher test scores were more likely to be admitted to a competitive academic program when it came to academic success self control was a more important factor than iq scores self control is a muscle it takes practice patience and dedication to strengthen it properly so let's see how to master self control number 1 set small set small goals and reward yourself for completing them for example if you want to reduce your facebook instagram time start by leaving your phone in another room for 30 minutes then gradually increase your amount of time spent away think big before acting upon your impulses temptations and distractions think about your future when you understand the long term impacts of your behavior it's easier to maintain self control get some rest you lose impulse control when you are tired and don't think clearly make sure you sleep for 7 to 8 hours at night exercise if you are into full body workouts good but even the smallest bits of workout can wake up some part of brain responsible for self control get to know yourself unless you know your weaknesses you won't be able to control them pay attention to what distracts you motivates you and draws your focus then you can use this information for improved self control some foods are better for your brain performance look for foods that can help you maintain a healthy level of blood sugar a single banana or a glass of lemonade is enough to give you a quick boost of glucose levels negativity only holds you back 
if you don't believe you can do it you are probably right so flip the script by keeping a positive mental attitude practice delayed gratification use self control to avoid reward until you complete a goal then when you finally earn it you are creating positive reinforcement for number 1 reaching your goals and number 2 practicing self control 8 download an app many tools are available to help build healthy habits and curb bad ones look for apps and browser extensions that cut off after a certain amount of time or apps that allow you track behavior and reinforce them with virtual rewards set clear boundaries not every area of your life needs rigorous self control as long as you are not harming yourself or others you can allow yourself to be distracted Let's see some wonderful terms. Discipline. Discipline is the ability to direct your energies into something even if you aren't particularly feeling motivated. For example, a student who is able to study for hours at a time despite feeling bored and demotivated. Will power. It is the ability to plan something and then actually do it. For example, planning to stay away from social media platforms for a week and actually doing it. Delayed gratification. The ability to accept pain now to gain a benefit in the future. For example, avoiding sweets in order to lose weight, look and feel better. Emotional regulation. It is the ability to act in an appropriate way despite having a emotional surge, emotional urge to lash out. you choose to say nothing or something reasonable let's see benefits of self control improved decision making greater chances of success in life healthy relationships less unhealthy cravings such as for alcohol or cigarettes increased academic performance improved physical health better mental health and well being ability to set goals and achieve them control over anger and frustration more self confidence and self esteem and better leadership quality thank you